New to Civil 3D 2012 is the addition of settings that control the level of detail, or the LOD, when displaying surfaces. The level of detail display control simplifies objects in a zoomed out view and works in both paper and model space, but does not affect plotting. Let's take a look here at the surface that I have. I'm just simply going to zoom out, select my surface, go to my surface properties and the statistics tab, and take a look at the values that are associated with my surface here. Again, I'm going to select my surface now, right click, and take it to the object viewer. Note the speed at which I'm able to manipulate this inside the object viewer. Now I'm going to move over to my View tab and turn on my level of detail. Notice the prompt that appears. It's alerting us to the fact that the level of detail will stay initiated until we go and turn it off. Notice the immediate change in my drawing. There are less triangles that are being viewed. Let's go ahead and zoom in here and notice the level of detail again. As we zoom in, more triangles are becoming available for us to select. I'm going to again select my, my surface here, right click and take it into the object viewer again. Again, I want you to note the speed at which we are able to manipulate this surface in a zoomed in manner in the object viewer. Now I'm going to zoom out. I'm going to select my surface. And now I'm going to try to edit my surface by swapping edges. Notice the red glyph that I'm getting while I'm zoomed out. If I zoom in, notice once I'm zoomed in enough, the glyph disappears. Again, if I zoom out, the glyph appears again, and it's saying that this operation is blocked until we zoom back in. Things to note here are that editing commands only work in real level of detail and apply to all surfaces except for watersheds and, and user contours. The payoff is that surface models are easier to work with, memory usage and regen times are significantly lowered even on 32-bit operating systems, and general performance enhancements have been implemented as well as that will positively affect time to draft sections, complete updates when corridor models change, and speed at which users can create, draft, and edit large pipe networks, as well as improve the use of the drive tool.